e-com sales, listen, do these 10 things. Now we say 10, but right now, because we did a prior video about top 10 things to increase your average order value, we're going to dive in as promised into detailing each one. So today is all about, Karina, what is it all about today? This is about the free shipping threshold, which is really important, but a lot of people don't think about it. So the first thing we want to say about it, because you might say, well, how can we increase how much someone buys from our store with a, with a free shipping threshold? Well, it even works for us. Like if we go shopping, if I see that, like, I'm going to give you some examples here. And by the way, Shopify gives you the, the free top banner on their Shopify theme. So all you have to do is change what it says to free shipping on orders over hundred dollars, for example. So let's show and tell you with some real live examples. Here's some real live examples. This, this particular website has free shipping for orders over $150 for limited time, you know, and 30% at checkout. Awesome. Ladies online boutique has free shipping on orders, $50 and plus circle square has free us Canada shipping on orders over a hundred dollars. Pura Vita, which is a multi, 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 multi million dollar company has free shipping on orders, 58, 21 uh, Canadian. I'm in Canada as I record this. That's why it's there. So this is huge. And so the next part that we want to say real quickly, and I hope you're getting this because these are simple things you can make to your, your, your e-commerce store website to make even more sales, or especially if you're just starting out, it's a way to start your your e-com store with the biggest sales for your time and um, and your store. Go ahead. Well, more profits, right? I mean, yeah. you're selling the same same stuff, but you're selling maybe just a little bit more. So number two is determine your free shipping threshold. So you don't just want to take a random number. You want to take your current average order value and make it just a little bit higher because the free shipping threshold isn't to reward someone that's already buying. It's to make them buy more. So if your average order value is, let's say, $48, you want to make it at least $50, maybe $60. If your average order value is, let's say, $79, maybe you want to make free shipping at $100. So you're encouraging them to just add one more thing to their cart. Yeah, that's that's huge. So let's go into the third way. I'm going to make it even bigger. So if you're watching this video, you can see it even better. Karina and I always laugh at this, that so many people don't do it. And I don't know why it's not build it and they will come. You have to announce it to the world. And there's so many free ways to do that now using organic outreach on social media and also starting to build your email list and sending an email out is you got to tell people about it. So meaning driving traffic to your site via social or email. And Karina, I, I, we, we have like about a minute or so still to talk about this. One of the ways that we love doing this is building up your audience on Facebook and Instagram. Like that is a marketing channel that works so well, two channels. Any Anything else you want to add to telling people about it with those marketing channels or, or email? Right. Well, so anytime that you're doing something that's important on your store, you want to announce it on social media and send an email and you can use the same content to do that. Don't just make something on your website and hope for the best that people are going to know that it's there. So that's the most important thing about number three. Awesome. So hip hip parade, it's going to be a great day for you when you increase your sh shipping, free shipping with the average order value. So thank you so much for watching this and go ahead and give our page a like.